What's up guys, Camjo here, and today I'm proud to announce that Flora Supply is finally live. But getting here was not as easy as I thought it was going to be, so let's talk about some of the struggles I faced as well as sort of where I'm at right now. When I started this journey, I set out a week to create my MVP. However, this quickly turned into two. Here's why. This was my first project in my 0 to 1k a month SaaS challenge. So I was a little optimistic with the one week timeline, but I think I'm going to keep that optimism because I think you'll only get somewhere if you keep practicing at it. And I know it's possible to launch a SaaS and create it in one week because I see people do it all the time on Twitter, Reddit, YouTube. I will definitely be keeping this MVP time to a week. Um, you're always going to run into errors when you deploy something like this. So keeping templated code will be one of the biggest helps to me because I actually ran into a lot of errors when it came to deploying the auth with this system. And I know you're going to tell me to use clerk and stuff like that, but I just don't feel like paying for any of that stuff or relying on another third party application um, when I already have some in my app. So I built it with auth.js uh, v5. So some of the errors that I specifically ran into were when deploying my Prisma um, application to Vercel, it was telling me that there were sometimes errors with the edge runtime and sometimes there are errors with the Node.js runtime. So I ended up having to go with the Node.js runtime because the edge compatibility was not working with me. Um, so that gave me a little bit of a time conflict and sort of delayed it a couple of days. Uh, so we're about a week behind, but I'm actually launching now and I'm happy to be where I'm at. So let's run through the product and see what we've got. So here we're on the Flora Supply homepage. And as you can see, I spiced up the landing page quite a bit. Uh, we've got a nice nav bar in here now, um, which we can browse all the sections with, as well as a good hero. Uh, so we can scroll down here. We've got some features sections that just loaded in, took a second. Um, can see we're built with modern technology, so we use Next.js, TypeScript, Daisy UI, and Lucide icons. Um, this will probably be updated to Next.js 15 because obviously we just had Next Conference where they released Next.js 15 a couple days before that. Um, I updated my pricing cards a little bit. I had some recommendations on Twitter to update these to a dark mode, but I really was not feeling it when I put it in there. Um, I still have the same FAQ, but then I've changed up the footer a little bit uh, and added the newsletter sign up on the uh, main landing page. And then you can see I also have a nice little tag down here for this series on YouTube um, so that people can find us and check us out. All right, so now if we want to come over to the actual dashboard, we can see that we're greeted with the welcome back. So I can enter my email here and click send magic link. And I'll be told to check my email to log in with my magic link. So we're going to go ahead and navigate over to my email and check out the email. So you can see here we have our auth email from Flora Supply. And if we click sign in, we are redirected right back to the dashboard. So now we've created an, created an account and it's that simple. Um, so now we have access to all the components. So we can come into the hero here and we can see that we can get access to this hero component. So you can literally just click copy code and then go and create a file in your own Next.js project and you'll be able to use this code instantly. Um, and it's the same with the premium components, uh, it's just you have to unlock these before you can see the code for them. Um, but yeah, so we have tons of different stuff. Uh, you can actually see like this is my footer in a little bit of a different layout. And I've included those components because I want to show like what kind of a landing page you can actually make with uh, some of these components that I've created. And basically all of these sections, you can put them together to create some really extraordinary things. So you can see this is sort of like the same style uh, as my landing page. Um, but yeah, so they're all interactive, um, they're all mobile responsive and stuff like that. So you can use them in all of your professional grade projects and every venture you want. Okay, so to talk about the zero to 1K MRR challenge real quick, um, I did some math on the floor supply product and we're currently selling premium plans for $9 a month. Um, so to reach 1K a month, we would need 112 premium plans every month sold. Um, so that would get us to our 1K a month or just above the 1K a month target. 
Um, so we can assume uh, that 5% of signups, uh, like the free signups, will go pro, uh, meaning we would need 2,240 free plans uh, signed up because we can assume 5% of those people will sign up for the pro version. And then we can assume from our landing page, we can get 5% signups uh, from just visitors, right? So visitors signing up for the free plan. So if we need 2240 free plans, we would need 44K visitors. And I said every month, because if we want to keep the 1K a month, um, that goes into like churn and user retention and stuff like that. But let's just say 44K visitors and we can drop the month, right? So obviously these numbers don't really work and this is a very niche product. So I don't expect to hit the 1K a month with this product, um, but it sort of tells me a little bit about products I should be launching in the future, right? Um, I should definitely be focusing on these numbers before launch and sort of doing some calculations as to how this could go, right? Because if you're even, even if this was a 29 or a $39 a month product, it changes these numbers drastically. In terms of talking to customers and actually engaging with people, I think the best way is to have them join the Discord or for them to email me. Um, and while email is great, I don't love the whole back and forth thing. I like Discord because like we're just talking. Um, it's really easy to communicate with people and you can have a community of people in one space uh, so you can get problems solved pretty quickly. All right, so you guys can sign up for Flora Supply today at flora.supply. It's completely free to sign up. There is a premium option for nine bucks a month. You'll get access to all of the premium latest components. This is my first SaaS product that I'm officially launching, and I'm really excited to get started on this journey. I'd love to know what you guys want to see next out of Flora Supply or my 0 to 1K MRR challenge. It's been really, really fun so far, and I'm going to continue on this journey until I hit that goal. So yeah, make sure you subscribe, join the landing pad so you can talk to me and all of the other great entrepreneurs in there and have a great day.